Yeah. Give it up for TV Pedersen, everybody.
why they made it, okay? Uh, St. Patrick's Day, they have a sponsor. Was it uh, Killian? Jane Hall. All right, now, so for Juneteenth to work, oh, I'm sorry, July 4th, that has a sponsor. It's of a wild turkey, Budweiser, fireworks, and care first, right? <laughs> I'm sorry, you can't have the fireworks and alcohol without some medical. Sponsors, something in Crown Royal, maybe Hennessy. Yes, yes, yes. See, and once, and once, once they get on board, once they put their money behind it, we got it made, okay? Because everybody loves drinking holidays. How many people were drinking on St. Patrick's Day and they are not Irish? Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. How many people are sick drinking on um, Single to Mile and you're not Hispanic, Mexican, Latin, 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 Latin. I guarantee you, on Juneteenth, we will all be drinking somewhere together, either cognac or whatever it is we'll be drinking. And that's, yes, that's how we're going to, that's how we're going to get, that's how we're going to make the country a better place. Forget the, everybody has a month. There's only 12 damn months. You don't even know whose month it is. When this month was, for April, I think, or March, or, I don't know. You know why? It doesn't matter. You know, you know, you know women need their own holiday, because they're all, they need their own holiday. Now, according to my wife, it's a day their divorce is fine. <laughs> that was my wife's contribution. Now, but of course, everybody does not get divorced on the same day. So, like President's Day, one day for all the presidents. Veterans Day, one day for all the veterans. Labor Day, one day for all the babies that were born. <laughs> I'm sorry, I never delivered a baby, but if I had to, I would think it was work. Oh, you were drunk. What about when you can see when you deliver? Oh, 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 there you go. Oh, oh we're going to get to that later. That would do well. And for me, if I go, if you're responsible for my license because I'm not, actually, I'm way off script. You so, know? I'll, I'll keep you on whatever it is. Okay, now, so, in order for women to celebrate their their day, their drinking holiday, it needs to be the day before March Madness starts. <laughs> because they're going to lose their husbands for two weeks anyway. They might as well just keep it going. The point of the for two weeks, okay? Or what about March Madness last? That's it. So, the day before March Madness, that is Women's Day. That is Women's Day, and their sponsors, let's see, could be, um, well, a sangria. According to Google, it's sangria. It's um, Cosmopolitan. Yes. Um, the um, the the uh, the, uh, the uh, martini. Yes, and the uh, the the kind of spice drink. What's that called? Uh, 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 I'm sorry, no. Um, but so we will have the holiday there, and so it's just before March Madness. So yes, well, you only get one day. Stop being greedy. <laughs> Because we're going to celebrate gay pride uh, the first day of spring because that's when there's problems. Uh, <laughs> now, according to Google, the preferred drink for uh, LGBTQABR, for that community is uh, IPA. The most popular drink among gay people is supposed to be the IPA. And I think, oh, and I think IPA stands for I prefer anal. <laughs> Germany, okay? Germany, they, they do it. This is getting too 
two world wars and, and, and tried to eliminate an entire group of people, race of people, religion of people, they tried to get rid of all the Jews. And you know something? Oktoberfest and we forgive them. <laughs> the Bible! I don't know what that means. I know so like we they, I mean, oh, that's what oh, yeah. the Bible. I don't know what that means, but I know it's a German. I don't know a lot of German words. I know um uh I, I know uh, I know uh, uh, yes, I forgot, that's German, yes. Uh, I know um Hogan! <laughs> I see nothing! Yes, I know that. If you're Hebrew, and I say time, you have to say like time, that means life, to life. But if you're German, you say hi, it means shark. Okay? Shark. Hi, shark. Now, here's the thing about that word shark. It should be universal. You shouldn't be swimming in a different place you can eat just because you don't speak the language. And you're just swimming, somebody's going, hi, and you're going, hi. So who can eat me? Unless it's about a hooker. Oh. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. And it's not that my wife doesn't have a little sex. I'm not going to hear from Germany. That's too cheap. I can't afford two tickets. I'm a comedian. I just told you I have no money. I can't buy two tickets. Man. So, but that's why I know we can just drink. Burst the end. We can all be like one nation. You know, voters, they're trying to be oppressed or not they're oppressed people, voters are being oppressed. You know, give them a day where they can drink. Not an election day, because you see what happens when they drink milk before an election. <laughs> or maybe, maybe the day the election is certified, so they can go like, oh, what have we done? <laughs> And that's there you go. That was a box set. It seemed to be an official holiday. I'm not talking about the things we do. I'm talking about the things that we can do. I'm talking about what we can do. Because what we do is one thing. What we can do together is something else. And that's what we need to do. We need to do all this together. Yes. With a drink to anything. Yes, I'll drink to that. We drink to anything. Amen to that. Oh. Now, see, now, St. Patrick's Day is kind of important to me because. You're Irish. Um, You're Irish. Yeah. Oh, I'm definitely Irish. <laughs> <laughs> I am 54% Nigerian, 27% European, 2% uh, uh, 9% Jewish, 2% I'm 2% um, Native American. And that is the Skim tribe, known for their milky white complexion. <laughs> <laughs> now, it, the light means, is that one minute? Whatever you want, sir. Okay, I'll try to wrap this up with a, a, a laugh of some kind. Uh, <laughs> that doesn't count. That doesn't count. Okay, well, uh, let's try this. Um, I'm going to do one thing about COVID. Um, now, COVID has impacted everybody. I mean, and, and the, the weirdest thing is, first of all, I, actually, I mean, I like a bandit because of my age. I got to go to the stores before things were too bad. But <laughs> what happened, I went to the store and there was like no toilet paper, no, no toilet paper towels, no milk, no bread. And I wasn't impressed. Because I see that every time there's a snowstorm. <laughs> every time there's snow, that's what I see. I'm like, my wife goes, look at that. I'm like, please. <laughs> snowstorm. It'll be back fun. You know what it hit me? When I went to the cat food aisle, they didn't have any cat food. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Shit, yeah. You know, cats will eat you in your sleep. <laughs> cats, will, cats will eat you in your sleep. Now, they're not animals, they have rules, but they don't just like, eh, yeah. no. They'll lay across your face and smother you first. And then, they'll eat you. Okay? So, I just want to find out what the hell is, is up here. I went on, I went on the internet. You know, where people can find friends. You know, if you have a, uh, if you like trains, you can find friends. If you like cheese, you can find friends. If you like um, asparagus and capers, you shouldn't have friends. <laughs> but I went on the internet and came up that there was an aluminum shortage. A can shortage. So you got me fucking kidding me. My cats are going to eat me because we don't have cans? Yeah, how about that? I said, look, when I was a kid, and I was born in 1959, you can do the math. If you can't, I'm 41. 